Mainly, I wanted to discuss the difference in your performance between last year and 2020. You were the top rated employee in 2020, but it doesn't feel like you've been nearly as present or focused since then. Yeah, yeah. What's changed? Well, yeah, so 2020 uh, was the second year in a row I didn't get a raise, even though I was the top employee. And when I asked why I couldn't get a raise, you said it was because of my position. No, my pay was a fair market value for my position. And when I asked for my pay falls on the pay grade scale, you said it was below the median. So the below the average of what I could make uh, in my position. So at that point, I just decided I'm going to become a fair market value employee and put in a below average amount of effort because that's what I feel like you pay me to do. You've created an environment where there's no incentive for me me to work hard so I don't. This man went viral on TikTok for demonstrating the trend known as quiet quitting. A TikTok user named Chris shared a video that he says is a real conversation he had with his employer about his performance at work. His department head called him to discuss the difference in his performance. She went on to explain that he was the top performer at the company the year prior, but had seemingly lost focus and was no longer engaged since then. Chris nodded his head in agreement, admitting that his performance had recently declined. He explained that in the year prior, he failed to receive a salary increase for the second year in a row. Though, as she had so thoughtfully pointed out, he was the top employee. He had asked why he did not get a raise and was told that his pay was a fair market value for his role. Yet when he asked where his salary landed on the pay scale, he was told that it fell below the median, which he took to mean that he was being paid below the average salary that he could make in his position. Chris then told her at that point, he just decided he's going to become a fair market value employee and put in a below average amount of effort because that's what he feels like they pay him to do. He told her that the environment the company had created provided no incentive for him to go above and beyond, so he didn't. High performers can often be left demoralized, especially since it is not uncommon to be rewarded with more work without an associated pay increase. This can lead to exactly what we saw in the video, a practice now referred to as quiet quitting, where a person stays on the job but does the bare minimum to stay employed. Many workers are changing how they view employment. No longer are they willing to settle for being underpaid or dissatisfied with their work environment. Traditionally, many workers viewed employment as a long-term commitment to a single employer, with the expectation of job security and benefits such as health care and retirement plans. However, with the rise of the gig economy and the increased availability of remote work, many workers are looking for better pay, for more flexibility and autonomy in their work arrangements. This has led to an increase in freelance and contract work, as well as a rise in the number of workers who choose to work for multiple employers simultaneously. Overall, these shifts in how workers view employment are transforming the job market and creating new opportunities for workers.